I guess this is a perfect day for me to do a day in the life because in reality, I don't have a lot of extravagant things that I do every single day. This is just me being real, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to my life. <laughs> How's, <clears throat> how's it going, my big bros? It is Alduin here, just uh, just another day in the office, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, it's not what this video is about, but a, a little part two of uh, of my self treatment. Today is gonna be the day where I have burger time. It's been it's been a long time since I've had burger time. I'm gonna be driving over there right now. Burger time's a burger joint, if you couldn't tell, in my town that uh, that that produces just some banging, banging. Burgers. All right, just gonna grab a pretty thick one here because you know it's it's still bulking season. I can do whatever I want, eat as much as I want. I had to readjust the middle part here a little bit. I put some product on it because it kind of looked it looked really flat earlier. I don't know what it's looking like right now, but I know it's it's looking it's looking decent. All right, like I mentioned yesterday, it's not like as long as it should be, or it's not at its ideal length of the middle part. Back in the day when I used to have one, I say back in the day when it hasn't even been a year yet. But speaking of which, uh, this kind of reminds me of it because I I got the middle part right now if you guys looked in my channel and scroll all the way down you guys will see a channel called aldwin 2 aldwin 2 used to be just kind of like my throwaway channel where i would post just whatever i wanted it started off as a music reaction channel i made like a video about the lewis capaldi album or whatever and after a while i came back to start uploading on that channel again where i uploaded a critical style videos where it's just like daily slop i'd be posting anything from like you know whatever topic that i wanted to do like let's say any type of drama that i would you know encounter anything that was like getting popular at the time so i remember i uploaded a video about uh sniper wolf quibble cop i remember aiden ross all that kind of stuff i, I uploaded a good amount and the reason why i'm mentioning is because uh, at the time that's when i had my middle part and that was kind of around the peak of the middle part so if you guys are interested to see what it looks like at its peak go and check it out and i still had my highlights at the time so you know it, i i know it looks good thank you so much almost forgot my drink oh boy by the way boys let's uh oh jesus bro <laughs> my car smells divine let me tell you that all right it is heaven in here for big backs like me this is heaven like i could not ask for a more perfect smell in this car right now it smells like burger man it's ugh. Can't wait to get home, man. Can't wait to get home and munch. With that being said, let's go home and munch. Aha, uh -huh, back on the electric chair again, boys. Except this time, we're not getting electrocuted. We're getting blasted with just flavor. We're getting taken to Flavor Town or Tasteville. Either way, we're getting taken to a place where I want to be. And that is satisfaction from food. Yes, always. My priorities are always in check. Every single time. I want food. I get food. Let's just try the, the onion rings here, boys. All right. It's been a while since I've had burger time, and I'm quite excited. I'm quite excited to be back into the grind again. Probably gonna have this a couple more times before uh, before the bulk ends. This whole order, I'm not gonna lie, was a little bit expensive. Uh, burger time in general is a little bit on the expensive side, but it's not too bad. This whole order was $21.38. I got a double patty. Does that justify $21.38? I don't know. Fries are delicious. Not fries. Um, onion rings. I also got a nice little brisk iced tea here. This right here is the burger. My hand for scale. I have a pretty decent sized hand. Here's a can of bush light. It's, <laughs> it's bigger than the can. Let us unwrap this puppy and see what we got working with here. What do we got? Oh, Papa Aldwin, what did you order? What did you... All right, relax. Let me explain to you. I got a jalapeno cheeseburger. It is massive this looks like a flying saucer son can't even imagine how much calories is in this like look at that oh my god jalapenos and everything i think i'm gonna add a couple more sauces into this without further ado ladies and gentlemen i've been excited for this all right let's take us to flavor town damn i'm pretty satisfied the flavor is outstanding everything about this is outstanding the onion rings Crispy, nicely made. I think it's probably just like a frozen type of um, onion ring. The burger is delicious. I do wish that they did toast the buns. The bottom bun is definitely soaked, which I'm not entirely sure why that is, but I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it's because of the way they package it. I'm sure that's the reason why it's like the, the bottom side of the bun is uh, very moist. That's okay though. Point is, the reason why I haven't been to burger time in a, in, in a minute 
is because of the distance. Right here from my house, it's about 15 minutes away. Maybe a little longer than that, like 15 to 20, give or take. Granted, I do live closer to burger time now, but it still takes about like 10 minutes, give or take. You know, it's not too far. It really, like, it shouldn't be anything to complain about. But if you take that distance from my apartment to burger time and you compare it to what's nearby, I just don't think it's, you know, it's worth it to go that far all the time. We got five guys close by. We got sickies close by. We got jail beers close. It's... There's a lot of other options. If Burger Time did open up right by the mall, like I would go there all the time. That's the only reason why. <laughs> That's the only reason why is because it's 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 not a ways away, but it's you know I have to go a little extra just to go there. I'm gonna have a bit of a alone time with this burger, and I'll go to the gym later anyway. So not not right now. We'll go there later. All right, I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna. I'm gonna... <laughs> Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another... I'm saying it like an intro, but, you know, the point is... Welcome back to another lifting session. Today is push day. Since for some reason the house didn't have honey, I had to revert back to what I used to know. This is the Rise Godzilla right here, boys, and, uh... And, and it's it is quite good. It is quite good. We got a push day today, and I think I'm gonna do something a little bit different. I'll kind of experiment in the gym a little bit, but um, we'll, we'll talk about it when it's done. We got a pre-workout running in our system here. I don't even know the last time that I used pre-workout, but here we are. I'm gonna get a pretty good pump no matter what. I'm boy's gonna go hard. Let's get this bread, ladies and gentlemen. I'm feeling good. Like an hour and a half nap or almost two hours. Feeling ready to tackle this, this lift session with a smile on my face. I'm just yapping at this point. All right, let's go to the gym. It's been a minute since I've felt that like tingly feeling when I take pre-workout. So that's how you know it has been a long time since I've taken pre-workout. I took it earlier and your boy was feeling it in his face. Pause. <laughs> your boy was feeling it, let me tell you. So today was chest day, of course, push day, sorry. Solid lift, went pretty crazy. Did a couple things differently. I didn't do shoulder presses. I just did double lateral raises. One with the machine, one with the dumbbells. Three chest workouts, that'd be one with the cable flies. Dumbbell presses, since people were on the machine, or not the machine, people were on the uh, plate loaded press. And then also I did a Smith machine press, so. And then triceps too, of course, but it doesn't feel like I'm bulking, bro. I can kind of feel the bulking, like right here, but I can't feel it like in my stomach. I don't know if it's because I'm just genetically like blessed, I guess, or I'm just not bulking, but I, I, think, it, I think I am actually bulking. It's just, I just don't get fat around here. I do get fat around this area though. You know what? I do actually kind of, I'm not, I, let me retract that statement completely. Like the abs are still there, but I can, I, there's definitely something. Um, it's not as defined as usual. This middle part's making me feel like BTS, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. In a good way, in a bad way, that I won't answer. Feeling real good. And now, I know you guys are gonna be disappointed in me, but I got offered this, all right? I got offered to uh, have pizza, all right? My parents came back today. When I get home, there's gonna be Papa John's waiting for me. I am really sorry, and I am sorry for my body. It's gonna be a bit of a rough day for my body today, because I, <laughs> I have burger time, and now I'm gonna have Papa John's. My taste buds are definitely thanking me, but um, the rest of my body isn't, let me tell you that. But I guess I'm getting protein, so it, it could be a lot worse, you know what I'm saying? As DJ Khaled would say, you know what? It's all good. Protein. <laughs> Please, please don't call me Big Back, all right? This is probably the, the most like Big Back way to end the night. And um, I understand, I understand the concern. And uh, you know what? It's all good. We're gonna end the night off with a thing of ice cream. We're gonna do two servings of this. Damn. <laughs> that was good. This last part of the video is just gonna be me yapping again. Just like how I did yesterday. I swear, I'm gonna start eating healthier again. Labor Day weekend was just me being alone. And I just, being alone, wanted me to just eat something just <laughs> Just really big bad. Briar's ice cream. Right. I guess a couple things I wanted to mention. One, I think I mentioned it already, but I'm really messing with the hair here. I think for now, uh, I'm just gonna run with the whole idea of having a middle part, and when I have a booking, I'm just gonna, you know, put it down and have a curl it and everything. That I think that's gonna be the, the move, so I can get the best of both worlds, you know what I mean? Without having to commit to one completely. And I'm honestly, I think I'm, I'm way, I'm, con I'm very content with that idea, just because, now you mentioned, man, I mess with this hair a lot. It's such a different vibe to what I've had in the past, like, 
however long. I guess to kind of show you guys a little bit of a show and tell here. This was my channel back in the day. Or not back in the day, but uh, a while ago. This was my channel, and this was like my curtain haircut era. If you guys are interested in seeing it, you guys can scroll all the way down to Aldwin 2, and you will see just a bunch of random videos that I made. Like I said, man, it was definitely, it was moist critical, like where I uploaded almost daily and i'd be you know i'd be talking about like stuff going on without you know without much editing i can't lie to you guys it was just me trying to like upload as much as i could and as quick as i could but i, I didn't really put too much research into this i think i ran with this for almost a month i think oh by the way i'm watching wrestling right here but i ran with this for about a month and i just kind of stopped this was my trial i guess if you think about it when it comes to daily uploading because this was almost daily and uh, i couldn't really do it for the main reason being it required me having to sit down in the computer for a while not just when making the video and editing but also like researching and stuff it wasn't as fun this this is fun to me this is like this is just chill this is why i like doing these daily vlogs but the point of me showing you this channel is uh showing you guys guys the the middle part this was the middle part right there i don't know when i peaked here i think this is past my peak i started uploading past my is it is it past my peak no this is about that around that time this was my first like uh slop upload it's funny because a lot of you guys actually don't know this channel this is my channel for a little bit man see the thing is i don't know if you could tell but i slept on this side because this was always flat i feel like that's gonna be the problem like with uh with me going forward with this curtain haircut. That's the only problem, really, when it comes to having this type of style. But I'm gonna try not to do that just so it doesn't go to that direction, but, you know, if it does, it is what it is. I was thinking of, like, a like a video title for this video, and I think I'm just gonna go with, like, a basic one. Aldwin Day in Life. <laughs> pretty basic, but I think that's the, that's, a, that's a pretty good way of describing this. Honestly, it kind of encapsulates, like, a lot of my days, like, recently. It's just me eating a lot, going to the gym, doing YouTube, and work that that's literally it and i guess if you guys are interested in sharing what do you guys want to see when it comes to videos do you guys have any certain ideas you guys want to see do you guys have any types of videos you guys want to see should i get the boys again and uh make uh mic'd up videos i do want to start going back into that because i think i think those are so fun to make so i'll start cooking up some more ideas for you guys right which by the way aj did post three video no four wait he's uploaded five videos in the past two weeks so Hey man, if you guys want to check out his videos, go ahead. It's uh, AJ Space Mosa. AJ M O S S A. So, tomorrow is the fourth week of the bulk. We will be halfway through, and um, I'm curious to see how heavy I am. Place your bets now, ladies and gentlemen, all right? Tomorrow's video, I'm going to open it up by, uh, by weighing myself like I did last week. So, leave your guys' predictions in the comments below. Am I gonna be over or under? What was it? I think I, I weighed in at like 156 last week. Am I gonna be over or under? If I'm under, I, I would go six feet under. If I'm over, I'd be happy. Closing in on two servings here. So I should probably end the video now. I think I don't, I don't really have anything else to rant about. I think we're done talking. Hope you guys have enjoyed the little yap session. This has been my little day in a life, I guess. I guess this is a perfect day for me to do a day in a life because in reality, I don't have a lot of extravagant things that I do every single day. This is just me being real, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to my life. I guess a little side note, the reason why I'm watching uh, wrestling right now is because I want to rewatch Bash of Berlin. I mentioned a couple days ago, I, I kind of missed like a lot of it. So that's besides the point, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you guys did, smash that like button. No. If you guys enjoyed it, you guys know what to do. But besides that, thank you all. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Turn around. No, I got a Options, begging me to go, but I tell her to stop it. Always got the key in my heart is to lock it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like a pro, but you're really a novice.